Have you been wanting to create an online appointment scheduling system? Let me show you how with JotForm. Hey everyone, welcome to JotForm. I'm Kimberly and let's create a form to help you schedule appointments. The first thing I'm gonna do is up in the top left corner, I'm gonna go ahead and click on create a form. I'm going to start from scratch with the classic form. I want this to be kind of like a strategy session so people can schedule strategy sessions with me. So I went ahead and changed the top header. I'm gonna go ahead and click the form elements. I want their full name and their email. Then right down here where it says appointment, click on that. Perfect. I'm gonna go ahead and scroll down. I'm gonna choose this whole appointment area. Then over on the right where it says properties, we can really make this fit exactly what we're looking for. So we can see we have the appointment duration. So if we want it 15 minutes, 30 minutes, we can go ahead and do that. I'm gonna make it a 30 minute duration. And then we get to choose when do we want people to be able to book time with us. So let's say, and we can use these up and down arrows or we can edit it right in here. So 10 a.m. to five o'clock is perfect on the weekdays. If we wanted to add a new interval, we can do that as well, like for the weekends. And then if we wanna add a lunchtime from 12 to two, we can. I'm good to work through that. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it off. And so now we can see we have those extra time slots that popped up. Another thing we can do is up in the top under limits. We can have a start and end date or we can have rolling days. So maybe like 14 days into the future. We don't want someone to schedule too far out. We can add vacations and holidays and we can also add maximum appointments per day and we can choose a minimum scheduling notice. So I definitely want to do that. So let's say I don't want to book more than three a day and I also would like 24 hours notice. I wanna have time to prepare. So you can see that it's automatically shifting and changing for us, which is perfect. Next, under advanced, we can choose the appointment time. We can do one-on-one -on -one or we can do a group. We can send reminder emails. We can set the time zone. We can auto detect the attendees time zone, which I think is really important. And then we can also change some other fields. Like if we wanna start it on a Sunday or the 24 hour format or AM, PM. So I think this is good. One other thing that I love to integrate with this appointment scheduler is I like to add an integration under settings. I love to add the Google Calendar. So when someone fills out this appointment, it's gonna automatically put it on my calendar. So I don't have to be coming back into JotForm, did someone fill it out or when was it? I can just look at my calendar and I can see everyone who has requested an appointment. So I'm gonna select the calendar and I want this to be under personal reminders. And with the title, we can click that little pencil and I'm gonna go ahead and put their name and then the appointment. So that way I know who it is and when it is. And then we have the start time and the end time. That's gonna be the duration. And if we wanna add the location description, you can absolutely do that. And then right here, create a new event when each submission is edited. So yes, I definitely wanna do that if they want to reschedule. So I'm gonna go ahead and click save, complete the integration. And you can do this with any calendar system. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to publish. Let's open in a new tab and let's give this a test. So let's say Sarah wants to schedule an appointment for 12 p.m. Perfect. So let's go to my calendar and see if it created one. And there it is, Sarah Perkins. So if you have any questions about creating your own online appointment scheduling system, please let us know and I'll see you next time.